we have to do field work, uh, which obviously is amazing. I think the main thing before I came is I was looking at the course and there wasn't really that much choice in my first year. You could choose a few modules, but that actually worked out really well because it meant that you keep everything broad and then you're not limited in the second and the third year as to what you can take and what prerequisites you need. I studied environmental science, but I did quite a lot of the ecology modules because I was interested in things like aquatic ecology, biodiversity, conservation, those modules as well. So it was good to mix those with the pure science, atmospheric science, those type of modules. We have to do field work, uh, which obviously is amazing, and we got to go to Carrot Fell, which is up in uh, the Lake District. And we were kind of looking at an old disused tungsten mine, and um, looking at the water quality in that. And although the weather was absolutely horrific, it almost adds to your experience. Uh, so I have lots of fond memories of kind of standing on the hillside, doing lots of measurements, having a massive laugh with all my friends at how ludicrous it is. I think my favourite module was soil science, which was a bit of a shock because I wasn't when I saw that that was on my timetable. I thought, well, I'm not really sure. I've never done that before. But then when I actually got into the lectures, it was something that I'd never studied before at A level or in school, and it was really interesting. And I actually did my undergraduate dissertation on soil, so I'd like that's something I'd like to take forward in the future. By the time you finish your degree, somehow everyone knows everyone. Uh, you'll have connections in places that you didn't even realise and that makes you feel like you're part of something whereas with big cities you don't normally get that. 